In this video, we will try to solve a numerical on Keynesian model of closed economy. The question is like this. Uh, in a simple Keynesian model of closed economy without taxes, if marginal propensity to save is given as 0.3 and increase in government expenditure by rupees 1000 crore will result in an approximate increase in country's income by the options are 3300 crore, 300 crore, 7000 crore and 700 crore. So we have to see uh, what would be uh, the change in the country's uh, income if expenditure is increased by 1000 crore. Okay, so let us say what we are given here. We are given MPS. MPS is equal to 0 0.3. Now we know that MPS plus MPC is equal to 1. That is marginal propensity to save plus marginal propensity to consume. Uh, uh, both add up to 1. Now since MPS is 0.3, we can write MPC is equal to 1 minus 0 0.3. This comes out to be 0 0.7. So our marginal propensity to consume is uh, here 0 0.7. Now what is our model here? We are given a, a Keynesian model of closed economy. So our income model would be like this. Y is equal to consumption expenditure plus investment expenditure plus government expenditure okay and since it is an uh, closed economy there would be no net exports that is x minus n is not here now what is our consumption function consumption function is given by a plus by okay since no taxes are involved so uh, this is our disposable income here plus the investment is constant so we will write i bar here and we have the government expenditure okay or we can write like this a plus b our b is uh, this uh, is also called the mps mpc mm, so this is a 0 0.7 0 0.7 y plus i bar plus g this would be our model here now what we can do, we will just transpose this 0 0.7 on uh, LHS. This will become y minus 0 0.7 y is equal to a plus i bar plus g. Okay. Now factoring y common, we are left with 1 minus 0 0.7 is equal to a plus i bar plus g okay or we can write it like this y is equal to transposing this term to rhs so this will get divided to each of these terms this becomes a our 1 minus 0 0.7 plus i bar our 1 minus 0 0.7 plus g divided by 1 minus 0 0.7 okay now uh, to see uh, the impact of change in government expenditure on total income, what will we do? We will just differentiate partially this uh, income model with respect to G because the question asks us about the change in the G. How much income will change if our delta G changes? That is our government expenditure changes. That means we have to differentiate that is del y our del g is equal to means we have differentiated we have to differentiate the uh, this very uh, function with respect to g since no g is involved in the first uh, term so here it is zero plus since these are the constant values here this is also zero plus the derivative of g is one okay one divided by one minus zero point seven so we have del y our del g is equal to 1 divided by 1 minus 0 0.7 is 0 0.3 or del y our del g is equal to when transposing this will become uh, 0 0.3 will become 3 divided by 10 
so this is here 1 divided by 3 over 10 and transposing this will become 10 divided by 3 this comes out to be 3.3 uh, so in place of this we can write 3.3 so I will write 3.3 that means our del y is equal to transposing this del g on RHS so we have here 3.3 uh, 3.3 times del g what is this 3.3 it is actually the uh, expenditure multiplier because government expenditure multiplier is given by that is our multiplier is given by 1 divided by 1 minus mpc okay and it shows us uh, how with how much factor uh, does our income change if there is change in the government expenditure so our del y is equal to 3.3 .3. now what is the value of del g since the government uh, expenditure has changed by 10,000 crore that means our del g that is del g is equal to 1,000 okay so this is our del g so in place of del g I will write 1,000 that implies del y is equal to this can be written as 33 divided by 10 into 1000 this uh, 0 and 0 gets cancelled we are left with 3300 that means our change in income as a result of change in government expenditure by 1000 crore will lead an increase in our national income by 3300 so the option A is correct. I hope I make myself clear in this video. Thank you.